Hey guys, welcome back. This is Mr. Hardcore Mode, where nothing's easy. Welcome back to more. Everybody's gone to the rapture. I believe this is Lizzie's story. Man, this rain. I need to calm down. Whoa! That looks like legit rain. Nice. Not a bad job. Not bad. Alright. So here we go. Jeepers. Uh, go away, light. Come. There we go. This is great. The weather keeps Lizzie, on changing. This is great. Rachel, hey, what on earth's going on? It's been awful. The thunder and the lightning, and all the power went out, and everyone was in the hall, so I told them all to stay put. And then Sean. Sean Davis said he was going to be told what to do by a stupid bloody girl and went out for a cigarette. And then Dick come back. And then Di, she went out after him and she didn't come back oh, either. Where is Dylan? Was he with Sean and Di? No, I'd be looking after him. Do you think they'll come back? I, I don't know, Rachel. Don't know? I don't care what anyone thinks. I just know if he was my baby, I could never leave him. Even if the whole world was coming to an end, I'd make sure he came first. Uh -huh. be a good mum, Rachel. Oh, don't worry. It's fine. Go, go back inside and tell everyone that they're doing a great job. A really wonderful job. I just got a few things to finish up here, and then I'll come in and join you. What are you hey. doing, Lizzie? Go on. Is she safe out here? Doubt it. Uh, and that's when Rachel died. Doesn't, isn't. Okay, that's where I need to go. To the left over there, since the light said. But this is where I want to go. Where's that? Where's that? Where's it coming from? Eh. There you go. Is this really ringing right now? You can't save them. Just pack a case and meet me at the station. They've closed the lines. Weren't you listening to the radio? Because of the flu. There is no flu, Lizzie. Oh, Christ, even I'm not stupid. Of course there's no flu. But the stations are still closed. There's an access footpath that runs alongside the main tunnel. You can get out that way. They won't have thought of it. You know what's going on, don't you? You can't use the phone anymore. What, like you're not using one right now? Funny. Listen. Just don't use the phone after this. No TV or radio either. It can hide in the signal. You make it sound like it's alive. I don't think we have a word for what it is. Just promise me. Don't tell anyone. Pack quietly. Meet me at the station tomorrow, all right? I feel awful lying and leaving all these people here. It was a brilliant idea about the show. Top marks for that, you clever thing. I love you. Oh. I'll see you tomorrow. Uh, okay. Bit of a love affair. Soap dispenser. Soap, bleach, softeners. I need all three. Because somebody named Steven is being a little dirty boy. Oh, can't get through here. Man, if they wanted to make a PT game... They could do it. They could do it. Closing that. No. I want to open that so I can verify that I was here. I still haven't gotten one single trophy around here yet. Hmm. Keep clear. I don't want to go there yet. Because last time, I went to Lizzie's story early. This is a public service announcement from uh. Haberton District Council Emergency Measures Committee. Road and rail closures are being implemented to help contain the outbreak of influenza. Please remain calm and in Local community leaders, teachers, scoutmasters, and members of the clergy will act as your representatives during this period. But be sure to report any symptoms of illness. Okay, it wants me to go there. Possibly. 
Alright, check that. Nope, can't go through there. But there is... Oh, this is the show you were talking about. This is the play you were talking about. Isn't Rachel the one that likes Reese or something like that? I don't know. Uh, this looks creepy. Alright. Yeah, it looks like people were trying to um, make this a safe house. There goes the Simon Says game. Yeah, people died here. You can tell from the light dust everywhere. Fine. What? You hear the footsteps on this shit? That's how I'm walking? Nobody walks like that. Uh... Hello? My name is Jeff. I, uh... I, this talent show, I show you, uh... I show you I can dance. Yo, come on, man. Do I have to go around? I have to go around. God damn it! You make me walk all slowly in here, only to not be able to do anything. And why is this still lit? Whoa, this is previously lit. Explain the situation, please. Out of Can't go through there. Mm, can't do anything in this game. I wanted to get to the phone, but I can't. All right, let me go around this building. Gosh, damn it, man. I'm coming, phone. Impatient bastard. No, I'll go there in a minute. I see this building. All right, reception, parking, the pool's that way. Tennis court, shut up! Ah! Run in the house, run in the house. We're not even really talking at the moment, if I'm honest with you. I've been sleeping in one of the empty chalets. Otherwise, we just sit there in silence. And then he goes off and pretends he's not drinking from one of his secret little stashes. And I pretend I ain't noticed, and then when we go to bed, it's all I can do not to scream. I don't know why we're still together. Except talking about doing. Robert. Still love him. You remind me of Mary when she was your age. If we'd had a daughter, I'd have been proud if she'd turned out like you. You don't have to say that. Just talk to Robert. Tell him you know he's drinking again. You two can work it out together. I know you uh, can. I wish I had your faith. I just don't want to be the person who stayed because they were afraid to move. You're I being that you right now. On the past. I know that, but sometimes you do just think, don't you? What if the accident hadn't happened? I could have been anywhere right now, rather than stuck here, rehearsing Peter Bloody Pan and fixing tumble dryers for the umpteenth time. Oh, Frank, you are an angel. Don't be that. You're still young, Lizzie. You? you got plenty of time to be whoever you want to be. Just don't keep using that leg of yours or that husband as an excuse. All right. Where do you want me to go? I know you're following me. What the hell do you want? That sounds like screaming. Okay, okay, I know where to go. I know I need to follow that way. But I gotta go to this ringing. You put me in this giant house village not to explore. No, I will go my own way. What? This is a public service announcement from Haverton District Council Emergency... Why is it making that sound? When I... <laughs> Why is it making that sound? ...the outbreak of influenza. Please remain calm and indoors. Local right. community leaders, head teachers, scoutmasters, and members of the clergy will act as your representatives Open up. during this period. Hi, this is Kate Collins and Stephen Appleton. Leave a message. What? Stephen, it's me. Oh, shit. I'm leaving. I've waited as long as I can. If you are there to meet me, I'm leaving for the station now, but I am going anyway. 
whether you're there or not. But I love you. Please be there. Wow. I what love that? you. Said it twice, right on there. She's got some some bowels. Okay, so that light's going that way. Oh, okay, I see it, I see it, I do. But you were trying to show me something else over here. Because I'm pretty sure it's a entirely... There's a whole entire circle going on over here. So I'm going to go check it out. And then I'll come right back over there, I promise. <laughs> it stopped over there down at that building. Now it's coming back like, you son of a bitch, you follow me. <laughs> you go where I say you go. I'm like, yeah, okay. Don't hit me again. Yeah, this is the only place. And then it leads up there. Okay, I got it. Alright, Lizzie. Your mission seems simple. I think it was instant. I, I know that's no help. Can you leave me alone? There was nothing we could do. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Oh, can a baby sleep alone? Rachel, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What? What was that about? Ugh, that was weird. Oh, I heard something. Yeah, there it is. I hear it over here. So did Charlie and Rachel? Is she like a little kid? We're probably gonna go to Rachel's story after this. I don't even care that he was screwing her. Oh! What made me angry was that he treated me like I was too stupid to notice. I dream through the light storm and see the pattern dancing on his skin as he burns. I wake up with eyes What? I'm going to concentrate all five remaining towers on the same point in the sky. If it is establishing conduits for communication, that should create a jump in bandwidth. She is so focused on work, she doesn't even realize what Steve was doing. Care that he was screwing her. I didn't hear that last but part that she was talking was about. He treated me like I was too stupid to notice. I dream through the light storm and see the pattern dancing on his skin as he burns. I wake up with eyes full of liquid light. That's odd. I'm going to concentrate all five remaining. Okay, that is kind of odd. What? If it is establishing Did you just touch me? My controller moved. Back. What? Go away. I will go where I want to go. If I want to play tennis, I'll play tennis. Hey, it's just been on the radio that they're closing the roads. Something about the flu? Oh, these no are kids. has flu, Sean. There's no flu here. I overheard Mrs. Graves, and she said another family of Upton left. She said they must have left last night, but the car and all their stuff's still here. Screw this day. There's 15 people up and left in two days. I don't like it. Where's the baby? Asleep in the caravan. Sean, I don't want to sit around you waiting for it to get worse. I reckon if we leave now, we can get out of the valley before they get their acts together and close the roads. You think so? Yeah, we can go the back roads, through the woods. I'll leave some money on the side for Mrs. Graves. You know her husband isn't back yet either. He's a boozer, right? That's what I've heard. That's your problem anyway. Don't be unkind, Sean. Come on, let's go and get there then. Okay. So... I guess those two had a baby? I guess? No. Mm, Rachel and Charlie. What is up with that? I want to know more on that. I don't think I can see that sequence again. I'll just look at the video later. If you guys can read the situation that happened here, just let me know. Alright, we're going to go back downstairs. Yes, now I'm following you. No, get out of my face. I don't like your attitude. We're going. Uh, do, 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 do. 
Doo doo do apartments. Hmm. Now I feel much better that I got all the information, eh? Huh? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. No. I'm coming. These are some awfully clean apartments here. Somebody definitely died here. And you found it like this? Yeah. I got into the habit of checking in first thing in the morning just to make sure he's had his pills. Mr. Coles is not a well man, Elizabeth. It's entirely possible he upped and wandered off. If things progressed, the mind can be a fragile thing, you know? It's just not very like him, that's all I'm saying, Doctor. He never misses the mid-morning bingo. He didn't smoke, did he? Not that I knew of. There's a funny... It's like ash. Well, that, that is odd. Reese cleaned in here yesterday afternoon. I'll have to have a word. It's not like cigarette ash. Strange. That's Dr. odd. Dr. Wade has just been a phone call. We need it back at the village. Apparently, Mrs. Barton has disappeared. All these stories are connecting. I always miss the chance to see the sky change back. I'm going. This is a lovely little... These are the cleanest... What's the word I'm looking for? These are the cleanest... Um, little RVs I've ever seen. Not RVs, but you know what I mean. I don't think I'm supposed to be going here. And the music is so good. Where'd it go? I hope I'm going the right way. I don't think I'm going the right way. It wanted me to go that way, but I wasn't sure. Because it was going back and forth, and I'm like, yo, I'm trying to understand what you're trying to do, bro. Hey, I heard something. There you are. Show me the way. It's this way. I knew it. I was about to go the wrong way. I tried to leave the observatory, but couldn't. I stood at the gates, but couldn't conceive of a world outside. The strangest feeling. As if the valley, Stephen, everything was simply irrelevant. What's up with you, Kate? Something, not as something itself. I'm losing track of time. Of whether I'm asleep or awake. What are you doing? My fingers have gone numb at the tips. It's like they still feel. But what they feel is no longer for me. Like the signal has been hijacked. Yeah, I'm definitely playing as Kate. What makes Kate so unique but um, to everyone else, you know? What's this little area over here? Is that a barbecue? Is it still on? That's impossible. Oh, uh, mmm, that's some good home cooking. What's that sound? This is a public service announcement. Shout out. Haberton District Council Emergency I need that mustard. Road and rail services are being implemented to help contain the outbreak of influenza. Hmm. Guess I can go in here for real quick. And go over there. This is a bathroom of some sort. Man, takes you forever to turn around too. All right, where do you want me to go? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, I gotcha. Move out of my way. You know, for an entity, you sure are a dick. Mm. Ow, I closed it on me. Mm -hmm. It's quite something, isn't it? I knew yeah, it. Yeah, it is. You ever seen anything like it? They must be well happy at the observatory place. They're probably all partying there right now. Or is it? Right, post. <laughs> it is. Right, that's me. Short leash. Kids up half a night, bloody teething. Mrs. will kill me if I'm gone too long. <laughs> Good night, Ned. Night. Oh, that was it? By the way, I couldn't see the observatory. Where are you looking at? Oh well. Come along, then. Uh. Alright, so we've seen these. I think it was leading the same way. Yeah, it was. I didn't miss anything yet. Be right there. Just need to fix this building over here. So Reese and Sean are friends, obviously. So the game has decided that I'm neither a girl nor a boy. Well, thank you. I guess. Alright. Where's the light? Show me the way. It's most likely this way. What's that weird sound? The rain looks so beautiful. It's well done. It. I think it's. I think it's starting to shine. I don't think I'm going the right way. Yeah, I'm not going the right way. Yeah. Most likely this way. Oh! Now we got lightning. You shouldn't be smoking, you know. Not in your condition. <sighs> Stephen's fault. He got me started again. What? I'm not going to try and stop you, but the weather's looking pretty rough. There's a storm coming. That's what Stephen said. Jeez, Stephen, Stephen, Stephen. But there's things he has to do first. He seems to think that all of this is connected to him. I don't know. I, I'm going anyway, whether he comes or not. I'm assuming Stephen has thought of a way through the quarantine. Well, he's clever. You gotta give him that. Do you trust him, though? Well, I love him. So I'd hope that was good enough. I hope so, too. Listen. All the love affairs. Through, for whatever reason, I'm uh, getting people together at the village hall, rounding up stragglers, that sort of thing. Yeah, I've got all the campers together here, doing a show. Peter Pan. The kids love it. It'll take their minds off things. Hey, did you see that? What? Woo! Alright, we know a little bit more. Oh, man, they had a thing going on here. Oh, I remember doing this. I would love to do one of these. Oh, that's cool. What did they see? I want to know your story, lady. Be sure to report any symptoms of illness. Alright. Which way am I going? Left or right? Where's the light at? Ah! Fine, I'll go about it myself. I don't need you! Ah! 
I need you. I need you. Mrs. Graves. Sean, is baby Dylan, is he all right? He's fine. Die. Come on. It's okay. Let's get you a cup of tea. Mrs. Graves, I need to tell you. Leave it. Die. Do you try and get out of the valley? All the roads are shut there. I know. I was driving really fast, but the other car was on the wrong side of the road, and... Oh, God, I think Die, he... for fuck's sake, leave it. It's all right. Hey, you're all right. Sean's all right. Baby Dylan's all right. That is what matters. Everyone's all right. But no. Now, I need your help. Some of the children, they're getting quite frightened. So, Rachel and I, we decided to push forward the show, keep them occupied. You said the other night that you play piano. Can you help with that? Yes, yes, I suppose so. But Mr. Graves, Rob... Can look after himself. He's a big boy now. Don't worry. Uh. Just head to the hall and find Rachel. She'll tell you what needs practicing. OK, thank you. Mrs. Graves. Yeah, Sean. Go and find Reese, please, see if he needs some help. Yeah, of course. Hmm. Go on. Did, uh, did they run over? Oh, Robert. Oh, they did. They ran over Robert. With this car? Nope, not this one. There's nothing in there anyway. Oh, well, that's how Robert died. Natural causes. Not liquid coming out through their eyeballs. What the fuck? What the hell was that? Alright, the only way we can go. I'm so glad this is easier, and everything's closer together, so I'm not running around everywhere. Man, hall. Oh, and playground. Open up! Fine. There's a light, it's telling me to go that way. But I hear something over here! I see where you're at. That's all I needed to know. All five towers are now operating together, and I've got the reception up to the red zone, but it's not enough. I'm going to try and route the signal through Tower 6 to create a singular point of reception and re-coordinate the optical array, which should, in theory, focus a signal spike on the point of origin. If I conceptualize this origin point as a seventh tower, then it makes a kind of sense. Kind of. Kind of. Moving so far beyond everything I understand about physics. Anyway, it's got to be worth a shot. She is so focused on her work. Weird noises going on around here. I don't like it. It's not my cup of tea. I saw something over there. The lake. Hmm. I don't know. But anyway, we're gonna end it here. I think we've done enough today. I will see you guys in the next episode. Leave a like and comment if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.